Bum 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 bum. Tomatoes. Hello, welcome to video four. What is array the contains node? I fired up a quick little example. Let's go ahead and check out how this works. So our contains node is pretty simple. Basically, if the array we give it contains the value we give it, it's true. If not, it's false. Now, this is a wildcard node, which means depending on how you create it, it's going to be either the direct input version or the input input version. Let's go ahead and cover that. If we go ahead and type in contains when we right click and go to utilities array, we're going to get the regular version. Because it's a wildcard, it doesn't know what type we're going to put in. It won't know until we plug it in. So therefore, it's going to have a generic input until we actually put something in. Now, the other version is if we drag off and then we type in contains. What this will do is at creation time, it knows it's an integer. So it's going to allow an integer direct input. So we could, for example, type in 10 instead of having to wire up another node. So we're going to use that version for our example. Our example array has one, three, sorry, one, five, and nine for our three values. Let's go ahead and check and see if we contain five. And we'll go ahead and run it. And if it is, it'll print out true or false on the top left corner. We run this and we see true because the array does contain the value of five. Let's say we type in zero and hit play. We're now going to get false. And that's it. That's as simple as it is. The array no the array contains node simply tells us if the input is inside the array that we give it. You might want to use it, for example, because you can use it for other things like an array of objects. You might want to check and see if an enemy exists inside this array. And if so, is he valid or does he not exist? Therefore, we should not count him towards our scores, various other things like that. If you have any questions or comments, Please feel free to leave them below.